back welcome back welcome back everybody it is your boy boogie here back with another sneaker review and today is monday april 1st april fool's day 7 19 p.m where i live and today we're going to do a sneaker review over the supreme air max tailwind fours i did get these last week like i said in my last video if you just watch i've been out of town for the last couple days so i didn't have time to really put a review out for you guys but i thought why not? I haven't did a video in three weeks and I need to stay consistent and drop these videos for you. So stay tuned. Here you have your Nike Sportswear box. It comes in that little nice, you know, pull-out box. And it says Nike up top. It is a pull-out box. It comes in your white paper that says Nike and Supreme on it. Um, I did order it straight off the Supreme and not the sneakers app. So it did come in a Supreme bag. And I got two box logo stickers. Um, and let's look at the label here. Nike Air Max Tailwind 4 slash S, which probably means Supreme. The color is black, hyper cobalt black. Men's size 9, women's 10 and a half. And suggested retail was a whopping 190, which I think is kind of steep. But I think these shoes were crafted very well. And the color code is AT3854-001. First impressions when I pull them out the box, these are really nice. Like these are way better in person than I think in pictures um they do look a little long for a size nine but they fit true to size even i would maybe suggest a half size up if you do have a wide foot but true to size and like i said the craftsmanship on this shoe is really nice it does have that um that uh air max plus sole on the bottom and the upper is kind of similar to the air max plus but it's a little bit different um you have a little bit of knit slash leather slash nubuck there's a lot going on in this shoe um so you like i see at the black sole which are air air unit at the bottom up top you have the mesh here and you have some like silver that's threaded in between that your navy blue uh nike sign right here you do have hits of leather all on the shoe as you can see just hits of leather wrapped around and then you got this chrome um mirror reflective color going on i don't even know how to explain it but it's it's uh all around the leather part of the shoe and then you have your blue your cobalt blue up top you have black laces um the lace holes are three m it looks like you do have supreme in the middle as well on the back it says supreme uh insole take out the shoe horn the insole is red it says supreme and nike and this shoe is it's kind of crazy. It's a lot of detail to it. It's definitely something you got to see in person. Um, I did like these over the white and red. Um, with the white and red, I just thought after a while, it was gonna yellow, look dirty, and I'm not gonna like it. Whereas the all black, I could probably wear it a little bit. I could probably, <laughs> I could probably wear it a little bit more. But um, let me know your opinions and thoughts below. Please comment, rate, subscribe, like, and share. It is definitely an interesting shoe. Um, with Air Max is being really popular last year and this year, I believe they're probably gonna do some Tailwind models, but I, I honestly don't think that they're gonna do as hot as like the 97s and the pluses and the 95s, which are really banging right now. But I think a lot of people who had these back in the day, real OG collectors, will love this silhouette. So let me know what you think below. Comment, rate, subscribe, like, and share. And if you wanna stay tuned, there will be an on foot. Thank you guys for watching.